saying that if I were a Bond villain and like the part where I capture James Bond, instead of divulging my whole plan to him, I would just lock him in a room and put this song <laughs> on repeat. And like would, really loud. That would too. I would actually like that would actually like tilt me for the rest of my life. Yeah, it would tilt you <laughs> until your head exploded. God and bless. Cover the whole room in grape jelly. Death by music. Oh my god. Speaking of grape jelly, look at her grape jelly uh, outfit for uh, Game Crescent. Is that grape? I'm colorblind. You're gonna tell me. Is that purple? Yes, it's purple. Wow. Or blue. Blue? I don't know. Whatever. No, we don't know colors. She's a, she's a crip. Uh, you don't need to know colors in second. You need to know red and blue. Rage. Right. Exactly. That's it. Wow, random Ooh. block. Flip kick. Is this should be the wall here. I don't. Never mind. Landon playing law. See, we were just talking about him. Yeah. Good this character. Is, he's been uh, trying to figure out what character uh, he wants to play, but he's been playing Paul because Paul's really good. But yeah. Just play with what? Double flip kick, baby. Double Down. flip kick. Wow, that was crazy. Oh, he tried to go with the mix-up. Yeah, that was interesting. I'm really surprised to see that he didn't break that throw earlier. Right, yeah. Two throws he didn't break. You know? I played against him earlier, and I tried every variation <laughs> of every throw I could with multiple characters, and he broke every single one. Like, unhand me. Like, yeah. leave me alone. Wow, he's flipped on him like four times, and they all hit. Which is ridiculous. Yeah. Doesn't get the DSS canceled. It's interesting because then it's a PC player, and so the DSS canceled. Uh, is different for the timing is different for PC and PS3. What? So you have to adjust for whichever uh no. you're playing. Yes. No. It's really dumb. No. Yes. No try way. it. Try it. I I'm gonna try it. Look, the timing is already different for me because like I've noticed that on PS4 for whatever reason is less laggy than the PC version. Interesting. I've never heard that before. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, ever since they patched it. Yeah, they they, they did patch it. Yeah. I can do that. Good punishing it to the. Uh, I don't know, the Round gambling. Three. He's doing the yeah, gambling. Trying movement. to steal the shoes is what it was. <laughs> Those <laughs> thorns are really bothering him down yeah. there. He wanted to yank them off. I mean, if they bother me, I yank them off too. Good stuff. Just throw it out. Should be the. Should we get a wall break? Nope. No, nope, goes for the DP. That move is so good. Is that down? It's like, I don't even know what the move is, but that tracking move from Eliza is just so cool. Yeah, well, I played Yank Crescent a little bit last week, and everyone told me. You just have to sidestep this character. But I, I tried, <laughs> man. I tried so hard, and everything tracked. Yeah, and that move that he did, the, the jumping kicks, Yeah, it's too homing. high. It's homing. And but it like, jails. Yeah, exactly. You can't even duck <laughs> the second hit. It's just like, what is this nonsense? Yeah. But I think you got to duck the first one and yeah. hold it. Pretty much. Good uh, float to the uh, combo here by Ian Preston. Coming back, let's see if he can adjust the, for the, to tie this up right here. Okay, oh. so I've I've learned that that dive kick is minus. Yes. Okay. It's and minus, but like the low jab crushes highs, and it's a low jab, so like you kind of have to like, even though it's minus, it depends on what you press. I see. It's like that plus mi one minus one game. In, in yeah, 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 exactly. It's exactly. not nearly the way that it's played in Street Fighter. It's right. like both players have a lot of options. Exactly. So. Wow, he, he ducked, ducked the homie and he stepped, he stepped in. in. <laughs> what is that? He ducked the first. <laughs> Look at, Look at that. I oh, love no. it. Wow. He knows. I love this kid, that, man. He said, I got my degree. That's big brain movement right there. <laughs> I got my degree. We Look have at him, so bro. many characters in the Tekken scene here, man. Yo, I swear to God. Can we change that? Can we get him, can we get him off the screen, bro? <laughs> That's disgusting. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's going to play the whole next match like that. <laughs> oh, no. He's not even going to look. I mean, that's that big brain. That's that big galaxy brain IQ. That's how you actually play Tekken. I mean, he did He did come in. His sponsor is Tim. T-I-M-B. I actually is going, going for it, but doesn't yeah. break. Is it? Is just got a friend named Tim B who pays his entry? Is that what it is? <laughs> Pretty much. Tim Brown. Yeah, but you know he's getting paid to, to, to play, but he can't break these graphs. Oh no, you got to get that handled. Exactly. It was punished though. Landon D, sponsored by Tim Brown. Right. Oh, nice side step from the floor. I think, or not plus like, Yep. Like plus seven, which is really good. You can't yeah. step. One, two, Ooh. three. Is that a natural combo, non counter no, hit? Not, uh, natural combo counter. Okay. Okay. Oh, wow! Good. That Sidewalk move, out of the game. That move is so good. Down forward two tries both sides, depending on the range or depending on where where you do it at. That is crazy. This is really good. Oh, back kick pressure. Okay. Nice side step. Side step. Letting him know. Hey, listen, I've been playing Tekken a long time, Yin Crescent. Exactly. I know you're new, and I know you're good for how new you are, but oh, look at that wind punish. He's punishing the the move glide. Uh, what is that? Move glide two? I don't know those characters' moves. I just know she's pretty good. That low is actually plus three on hit. Okay, wall break. There's the wall. wall. Wow, the Whoa. high level wall splats. Nice duck. Doesn't get a great punish, though. That was crazy. The punish on the, uh, the move. Someone's got to clean the back sweat off all the way up there. They're going to have to pull out a ladder. <laughs> right, exactly. This is a counter hit. This should, it might be the wall. Dab, running dab. Ooh, no, not quite. And That's all right. 
Wow. Lenity sitting in a lot of rounds now. He's gonna have to make some. Ooh, the lows. The biscuit, risk it off for the biscuit. Yeah. He had to though. Yeah, that's very true. That's very true. You don't want Law. Law is a very mental based character. You don't really want this character looking. You don't want him to get his turn. Right. Okay. Ooh, the lows are doing serious work for Yen Crescent right now. Good and punish. we talked about this earlier. Me and Landon played, and he said, you know, in this game, like if your defense is really strong, you have to low. Yes. You have to. You don't. They don't have any other way to do damage to you if you're if you're able to break all the grabs. Oh what? Ooh. Really feeling himself here. I think that was accidentally keep charge because. There's no way you're gonna keep that. But yeah, like if your defense is good, like low is like literally the only way they can they can open you up, and then that's how that's how you like you get the opponent to become predictable and like when they're gonna low and like when they're gonna mid and stuff like that. It's really good. Max damage on the wall. But he's getting tagged by so much here. He got tagged by the dive kick there. He's reading the low too much. Yin Crescent is putting him in the. Is this injustice or is this tagging? <laughs> oh no! What's going on? Oh no! Like that's that's a, that's a determined face. Look at that face. That's 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 big brain. Oh no, he's looking so he's looking so uh, confused right now. Maybe he should put the shades on. Yeah, maybe indoor maybe shades. That's yeah, a maybe, good move. Maybe it'll help him see the lows or yeah. see, the, see the flaws of his game. That's maybe it'll help him see the future. <laughs> help him make the extended reads. God bless. Round one. The maybe it'll give him a bird's eye view. Those are aviators. A little bit of Tom Cruise, uh, Goose, and Iceman. Okay, true. Okay, fair. He can fly high and fly upside down by one of those Russian MIGs, and, you know. Maybe he can actually see those grabs that he just hasn't broken. <laughs> has yeah, what is grab. going on? I, I'm almost concerned that he's playing with the Ink Crescent because I'm telling you, man, we played earlier and I tried every one plus two breaks, true one breaks, true two breaks, he, he broke everything. He has a new stick, so who knows? He did it with that stick, too. <laughs> oh, no. God bless. I guess the three plus four. I don't know if that, that was, was kind of a risk. It was, I thought you were going to say kind of random and I was going to agree. <laughs> like, it was yeah. kind of random, but it hit, so. You know. Look at the spacing. Oh, was God. That like. big walk up like that. Good Lord, Landon. The thing about this game is like movement is so strong in this game. Just like that wall combo, movement is so strong in this game. It does like a lot. There's yeah. so much. Oh, the parry doesn't get the combo. Landon's movement is very strong too. And the couple times that I played him uh, before we started playing here, Ooh, nice he is like he is like one of those guys like Steve H, where he can win an entire set with, with only pressing like five buttons. Yep. Oh, but wow. they're the only buttons he needs. Exactly. He did take a little bit of a break because of high school, which is understandable. Yeah. Fun. But he's been on his grind. He's been on a Tekken grind lately. Whatever. No excuses. <laughs> what did high school ever do for anyone? I uh, got him a uh, uh, high school diploma, maybe for like a job or something. I don't know. You know. But if this is his job, he didn't need to go to high school. Yeah, that's right. He should have been going to <laughs> YouTube University, Tekken right. University, exactly. and learning how to fight. He knows. We don't even need to tell him. He's right. taking so much random damage here. This is so surprising. Yes. King Crescent's doing a lot of work, though. His mix-up is real. Another throw lands. Jeez. Wow. Eric is not breaking throws. Dean Crescent actually, like, regained the momentum here. Yeah, absolutely. The rushdown is real for Dean Crescent. I mean, yeah. So good. Hasn't blocked that low. Nice whiff punish on the EX dive kick. Man, every mid, every low. He's jumped over. Every throw. Just get up. Oh, that we talked about it. No, that low's so hard to block. Because you, you think you should be able to parry it, but you can't. You have to block the low. Really? You yeah, can't parry you that? You can't parry that. It's dumb. Damn, why is that, you wonder? Uh, probably because it was pretty garbage either way. Uh, I see, I see. But uh, good stuff to Yen. Yen uh, taking this. Going 2-1 now. Yeah, this set is up. This stuff is lies. Will this be the first weekly that Yen Crescent will be in Grand Finals in Winterside to be able to win? Yeah, because usually he tries to run his way back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember uh, a couple weeks ago he played against Soft and Wet, Soft and Wet, no, Soft and Wet for um, in Losers Finals. Yeah. And he almost had it, but he's just like, Yen does this thing where he's just like, I have this. I'm gonna do whatever I want and just kind of troll, and then he just like lost control. Versus Noctis, who just down back one plus twos you and hits you no matter what. Which side you yeah, not over until it's over. Yes. I like that focus on the camera showing us Seth in the background. Shout out to Seth. Yeah, he was there. Shout out to him. I, I watched that though. I mean, I think I was doing commentator. Uh, commentator. I think I was doing commentary during that. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I remember Soft and Wet looking really relieved that he beat Yen Crescent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like he felt like he shouldn't, but he played his. He played yeah, well. He played really well. He played really good. Really well. Wonder. So, think. So, for all that don't know, Landon is the brother of LGR, right? Oh. And so LGR, we call him Moku Larry because LGR can play the whole cast. His brother is trying to walk in his footsteps. That's Larry's fall. brother. Yes, Larry's little brother. Yes. It's all coming together. It's <laughs> it all, all makes together. sense. It so, runs in the family. Ironically, they don't play together a lot. Really? They really don't. Huh. That's but, I mean, interesting. Yeah. But I mean, I don't know. You get you, you get your experience one way or another. That explains why they're both still alive. <laughs> I think in a way. It's not like Mario Party where like 
they play each other, you want to kill the other person, you know? Listen, I grew up playing fighting games ever since I was a little boy, right? Uh-huh. And I was born in 85. And so I was playing Street Fighter 2 with my brother mm-hmm. at six, seven years old. And let me tell you, fighting games, the meme around the house is that fighting games always escalate to real fights. Oh, wow. Okay. You know? oh, Jeez. So. Fight. Interesting. They're serious. They're serious. But if people get salty, imagine, that, like, you know, getting salty against your own blood. Oh, man. Know? I mean, I've done that t- I've done that before. Not not with fighting games, but with, death, with 2K. Yeah. You know? Imagine someone uh, getting salty against someone that you live with and know you're going to live with for, like, two decades. Right. And you got to wake up in the morning and say, hey, it's <laughs> the yeah. next day. But uh, landing going to the top of some tiers. Uh, yeah, going with Paul. Looking a little more comfortable with this good character punish. for sure. Yes, definitely. That move is so good because it's, like, plus one hit and it's only, like, minus 13. Wow, that's pretty good. Yeah. So no launch punish. Yeah. With most of the cast. Oh. Oh, wow, excellent. All the whip punish. He only needs one move, baby. God, death fist. Wow. That move is We don't need a combo. Right. <laughs> he just poured that power rate all over. Exactly. The blue stuff, baby. Goes with the outfit. No big deal. I think Landon do a lot more sidewalking now, which is really good. Helping him uh, evade some of these moves that are alive and doing. There, there we is. go. Ooh, he was plus on block, but uh, Yin Crescent didn't believe in the pressure. Does not break the two grab. It's his first grab. Oh! Woo! Oh. Death Fist. Good work, man. by Landon. This is looking uh, like quite the momentum. Though. Who needs training mode? Right. All you need Death is a, a quarter circle. That's it. <laughs> Let's do a fireball. The Shredder got low profile. That was interesting. Yeah. I would have thought that was two mids. It is two mids. It is. But you know, anything can be, anything is possible in this game. Any, anything is possible. Tekken 7. Right. Oh, that's long. Not long, dude. Ooh, the sidewalk got counter hit. That's too bad. The interesting thing about this game is like sidewalking in this game is like you can sidewalk to a certain point, but then some moves retract. Yeah. And so it's really hard to know like when it's your turn when you're sidewalking. It's just you just have to have that, that experience. Which is why side, sidewalk block is so strong. I would say in my experience that sidewalking is a very large risk. It's to the point that it's probably not that good. There's the throw break. Yeah, Landon's finally, feeling himself again. Finally gets the throw. Break. Let's see if uh the end crest is in his uh, comfort zone where he's just like sitting and chilling and, and letting Paul come to him. I didn't know that was a string. That's new to me. Wow. There's a there's a death fist. That's the first one of the round. I was gonna say goes for the, the demo, demo man. Too far though. Finish. Oh my Ooh. goodness. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Good lord. I think I think you need some water. You win. Glasses are looking a little crooked, oh or maybe it's the hat. I don't yeah, know. Oh, definitely. he did the Paul <laughs> pop up. I love it. <laughs> I, I want to see him do a death fist after this. Bro, I'm just saying, if you pop off when you're a Paul player, I don't have I, words I for you. I see what you're saying. I don't have I words know where for you're you, going. bro. <laughs> I don't, especially on a small stage like this where you hit, you reach the wall pretty much every down four or two. Yeah. I don't know, man. But let's see if Yin can adjust himself. Popping off. I really outplayed my opponent. Right. It's like, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, weren't you guys excited to see that death fist? Right. Random. De- he literally closed it out with a random death fist. Exactly. Wow, Ooh. tries a uh, trooper roll over the fireball. That's that's big brain. Good punish from being question with the dive kick. This might be the wall. Ooh, oh, no. just barely. Oh, he does clap a little bit. Wow, side step. There it is. And a perfect challenge and combo and punish and everything. Nice. Uh, nice recognition on the spacing to know that that would work. That would hit, it would wall splat. Yeah. Because if it didn't wall splat, he would have been uh he would have had another chance. Wow, cool. the snake, snake edge. edge. That's hard, man. That's that's one of the hard things to learn about in this game is the snake edges that come from the sky. Right. They're like tech cra- uh, tech jumps, so like it's actual viable move, and it like home, it's a homing move too. So like yeah. it's actually like, it's not a troll move. Covers know? ground. Right. Homes. Yeah. A lot of snake edges are used for defensive purposes. Like people, people are like, oh my gosh, you're a snake edge, but like yeah, they're they're actually like good defensive moves. Right. They're very evasive. Right. They go under so many mids, even ones that look really low. Yep. Demo man. Let's look at the wall. Oh my goodness. Woo! There it is. I think Ian Crescent probably got caught sidestepping there. Did it a little bit late. Yes. Fight. You know, 4 2, uh, four, two 1 just frame is very good. Oh my lord, down 4 2. This should be a wall push. Yep. Okay, oh, it goes for Oki. Yep. Yeah. Another another break. I'm Demo man one. right in his face. Another one. Another one, another one, another one. Another one. Oh, look oh, at that. Oh no. Standing there just <laughs> ready for it. I God was like. so scared. Oh, good. <laughs> no, 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 no max punish, but good, good block. I thought he was going to stand there and yeah. then just wait and just do it again. <laughs> Dude, I think he was waiting to do it again, but he ended up having to, you know, auto-block. Right. Had to think. <laughs> okay, he press and pressed the button before he got a chance. I right. Oh, ooh, that's, that's going to be a big punish. Is he going to hit the wall? Is there gonna, ooh, okay, he's not able to. Hand me! 
Okay, that's good crush. Wow, wow, that was a good confirm. He's right. crushing these combos, man. He is so crispy. Yeah. Oh, no. That could have been a punish opportunity for Lana, but he, he didn't believe. Yeah, he saw that, the dive kick in front of him, and he's like, uh, 2D character in a 2D plane. Nope, right. you're in 3D, baby. Now's an opportunity for both of them to uh, move on to a grand final. Nice sidestep death fist. Uh, why did I say nice sidestep death fist? Nice <laughs> sidestep. Unhand me again, peasant. Close to triple roll. Screw the wall. Screw the wall. What's okay. the mix-up? What's the mix-up here? Oh, he oh, tried he for the for a camera trick. If he would have hit that, he would have won. That would have been, 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 been Paul's life. Uh oh, this might be it. I don't think that's gonna be it. Okay. Oh. Oh. Death fist, death oh fist, my death lord. Fist. So scared. Landon pours the Kool-Aid on him. Okay. Oh. <gasps> Unhand me. Throw break. Reverse Real tense situation now. The Next size, guess though. wins it. Okay. Oh my lord. Oh. Ooh, really oh, excited himself. He, he didn't know about the projectile. That's too bad, Landon. Getting pushed to losers bracket, and I have a feeling we're gonna see these two again at grand finals. I but mean, uh, maybe the there's a the dude that Landon has to play is actually really really good. Okay. Uh, he's from uh, he's not from he's not from the states, but he came to Xanadu and he's actually really really good. 